All right, my question for the night is, should you take a baby aspirin? How many of you think you should? All right, good question, good question. It depends. So here's a study that just came out. I want to know, you guys are kept up to the cutting edge of science because of what you hear in this class, September of this year. This is Dr. Pat with the Seven Systems Plan, and I'm gonna give you your tip of the day starting at this study. All right, in this study, they took aspirin to decrease heart deaths. It was a primary prevention trial. 20,000 people over 70 years of age. It is important to note, this is people without heart disease. They're taking it to prevent heart disease. Okay, a little different if you have it. What did they find? Aspirin increased your chances of dying. 64 more people died in the group that was taking aspirin than the placebo, but it gets worse. The rate of cancer was 1% higher, resulting in another 68 people dying from the aspirin group. So did the aspirin prevent heart attacks. That outcome failed as well. Prevention with aspirin is not the answer. It is a killer. If you want more, look at the New England Journal of Medicine. Here's a conclusion. Aspirin doesn't prevent you from dying. In fact, it increases your risk. Now, if you have heart disease, you're in a different category. <clears throat> following the seven systems plan does prevent you from dying. So I want to encourage you to stick with the plan. If this information has been helpful, I want you to hit the share button on your phone. And as always, we have a free class every Monday where we give out a lot of good information for people interested in losing weight and improving their health. Thank you for listening.